What's going on you guys? Lara Productions here. Today, as you can tell by the title of this video, you know exactly what it's about. And I wanna discuss something that not a lot of people have motivation for. So I wanna explain how I've lost some weight over the past year. Now, a lot of you may not have noticed from your own lives or from different lives that you don't really care about my weight. However, I wanted to explain it to you because I know some people my age have been trying to lose weight and haven't really succeeded. So by that, I want to, you know, help you guys kind of persuade you, tell you my story about how I lost some weight. So I'm going to start with last year, probably, well, no, I'm going to start all the way back in 20, probably 2013. I... I was very greedy when it came to food. At that time, I didn't really know about, you know, weight loss. I was only like, what? I was, what? Let me do the math. Um, I don't even freaking know, but I was probably little back then to enough to where I would know about my weight, but not to the point where I would fully care about it. So I just, I ate and I ate and I ate until I actually became fat. So, I know a lot of people not say, oh, that's not fat, but for my age, I personally thought that was probably the most biggest I could have gotten. So, as the years pass, you know, how school is and then people make a fun of weights and all that other stuff. I really didn't like my weight, I but I tried and I tried and I tried and I didn't really succeed as well. So, by 2016, I just, personally gave up i tried working out i tried doing every cardio weight workout and nothing would work so i i was just like okay i'm done i'm, I'm not about to freaking waste any more time on my weight if it's not gonna work so that happened 2016 i was just like forget it it's just out of my mindset at this point i'll just stay the way i am 2016 came around and then i was like you know, I'm starting to get a little older. Once 13 hit, I was like, you know, this is kind of serious about my weight. You know, not that serious to the point where I'm an adult and I need to like make sure what I eat, but to the point where I should think about how I eat more often as far as chips or soda or pizza, you know, cake and cupcakes. It's like, it's just, I don't know, it's just not my type. In 2017, you, can guide, you guys can see from my videos how big I am. I've had like mirror mirror scenes, you know, where I've did my series back in 2017. Um, you guys can see how Lazarus is, how big he is, where my character, you could see how big he is in the mirror. You can see how big he is, or you could see from my face, you could tell like there's still a little bit of fat in my cheeks. You guys can see that in, in, in last year's videos. So, this year came around and then I was like okay as I saw I was like I could actually make a change on my weight now that I'm more bigger and you know I'm I'm just gonna keep on growing and growing and growing until this big fat pillow and so I'm just like nothing anymore so I'm just I wasn't gonna be let me say obese anymore I wasn't gonna be like that anymore so I was just like okay I'm done I'm gonna try to lose weight. I don't care what happens. I'm just gonna lose. I'm just gonna work myself out. I'm just gonna be like, I'm done. I'm just gonna work myself out. January, February came around, you know, the thought was still in my head, but it wasn't as much because I only went outside to play with my friends. That's really it. I didn't really do anything else during that time it matter. So I just went outside. I biked to public sometimes because Publix is like right up the street from my house. You know, I bike to the park every once in a while. You know, I just got into the concept of biking and running and all that other stuff so by august i had a why well, you guys weren't informed of that but you guys some of my friends and my family know i had a breakup back in august it wasn't gianna it was somebody else that i don't want to really get into right now um they broke up with me and i was not too happy about that so I started getting sluggish, I started getting lazy, I didn't really feel like doing anything but, you know, just let my emotions out. And 
you know, that's something that's normal because after a breakup, I know everybody's like, oh my God, you know, like they got to process what happened. They're just, they're just processing that they just lost their best friend. So I got sluggish. I didn't really feel like doing anything. That's why I was really cut up on videos in August. It was like, I only had like virtual reality and that's why that, that's why even that episode was just like, it wasn't even popular. It was just like, you know, it was just talking and you know so august wasn't really my best month i was about to say year my august wasn't very my best month so i just i was just like you know and then school came around so i had to worry about you know a breakup and then now i gotta deal with school and then i gotta get to with people and then rumors and you know this is high school it's like it's a whole new ball game and people knew so of course they're gonna come up to me and ask me stuff that i really don't want to hear so and then september came around and then i was like you know i was still a little bit sluggish but i was getting better September is when I met Gianna, September 14th. Gianna asked me out, and, or I asked Gianna out, and then of course, she helped me with that. October came around, and by the end of October, I joined the wrestling team. And the wrestling team is not a team that you would like to jump around and giggy. I mean, it's, it's fun, it's, it's fun, but at the end of the day, you know, it's not something you just do like 10 jumping jacks and then oh, we work and then we just wrestle for the day no we run like what two miles a day and then we'd probably run more in the gym so that was something that actually helped me when i was actually feeling pretty sluggish with you know my breakup and then after that i was just like okay you know <laughs> okay like it I honestly, I, I wanted to quit the wrestling team because it was hard, it, you know, being a big dude, you know, losing weight over the months, but still being having that fat from over the course of the years was not like through t 2013, you know, it wasn't really that easy. So by that, I, I, <laughs> I didn't know what to do. So I just did what I was supposed to do in wrestling. You know, I joined the wrestling team. I wrestle, I do cardio, we're probably gonna lift weights sometime soon. I'm not sure yet. But all I know is that from 2013 to now, you could see how much fat I've actually lost in my face. Um, like, like in the beginning of the year, you could tell my cheeks were somewhat bubbly. And then like, you know, by now you can actually see, you know, it's kind of, I kind of do have a freaking, what do you, what do you call this? A, I don't know what you call um but that that's all it so any of you guys who watch my videos and who have noticed this and are persuaded by losing weight you know go ahead go out and go do it like you know just put to put on some music you know imagine your significant other at the end of the race you know just cheering you on and if they are thank them because i thank gianna mostly every day because of she she might not believe it or she might have not seen it but she really has helped me throughout probably probably since august so that so any of you people who just just go out go do it i know it and it's easier said than done don't even don't even play the music but ah um you could just it's you could say you go and then you get out there and you're like, oh my gosh, you know, this is tiring. And trust me, it is tiring running three, four miles a day. But after a while, you get used to the concept of running and sprinting and, you know, moving around. Because that's what we do in wrestling. We move around. It's not no, oh, high kicks, you know, we stretch. But it's not like, oh, five jumping jacks. And then, you know, we go inside and then we play fight. No, it's like, this is full on. We wrestle, we fight, we challenge ourselves. This, it's not a game. And honestly, I wish I'd known that from the start since I joined wrestling back in the end of October. I wish I really knew that. Cause I was like, huh. Cause I remember the coach told me, he was like, be mentally prepared. And I didn't, I, I didn't think about that. I mean, I thought he was gonna, you know, it was just like some sort of metaphor or something, I don't know. But obviously I had to be mentally prepared and physically prepared because trust me, I still have what freaking, I have a bruise right here. What 
yeah right there on my shoulder i have that i have a bruise on my knee which i don't think you guys want to see but i have bruises everywhere and wrestling isn't a joke so trust me like as you progress it's just just work yourself out get somebody to help you because after a while you lose weight and then you're like oh my god i feel so much better now trust me after i lost weight moving around didn't feel like anything like this like if i was that big how it was i would have probably been like panting right now so just challenge yourself go out there you guys can do it i know you guys can because if i can and if you know a 400 pound man can look up those videos you know do that too look up my 400 600 pound life look up that and then see well i think some of them lose weight i'm not sure but look up some inspirational videos if this isn't enough look up some inspirational videos and you know say i could do it and then get somebody to help you if not then challenge yourself just challenge yourself until you actually feel good about yourself it's not about how you look it's like necessarily this is my opinion i don't judge people based on the outside but for me myself you know i was bullied back in what sixth seventh grade eighth grade and then it was just getting tiring so i wasn't about to go to high school and then just start getting bullied again so i was like no i'm gonna make a change in my life i'm gonna start moving around again so that's what i did and you guys can see now that i'm obviously fit compared to 2016 2017 so i just wanted to make this video to inspire inspire you guys and to tell my story about my weight loss so i just want to say thank you guys for watching if you like the video please give it a thumbs up it truly helps my channel currently it is what like december 27th so new year video should be coming out probably on the 31st <laughs> um anyways guys thank you guys for watching see you guys next time